remnants of a rainbow. Nothing like shooting a rainbow through a barbed wire fence, huh? <laughs> it's Texas for you. Wow, guys, <laughs> this is really happening. <laughs> I don't leave jobs well. I don't know why. I just. Battery. <laughs> Hey everybody, um, today is April 21st, 2021. It's for reals. It's for reals. This is going to happen. <laughs> uh, I'm a little nervous. I, I'll admit I'm a little nervous. I just talked to my boss and he assumes that my last day is going to be um, the 30th of this month. And it may as well be. Because, like I said, I haven't been able to get things done. And I think he'll work with me on the rent. So, actually, he offered to pay for transmission repair on the motorhome. <laughs> I'm not going to have him do that. I don't think he realizes how much that would be either. But uh, that was awful generous of him. He's really a good guy. So, which makes it harder to leave when you work for people that you like you know there's issues with tenants and such you know that i tend to have to take care of but you know it's also part of the job so yeah <laughs> this is gonna happen this is gonna be happening wow i don't even know how to process this <laughs> but this will give me the time to get my stuff done because while I was working, well, I still am, but while I'm working, I just can't get the things done that I need to. Now I will be able to. Wow. I have to hit it hard. I have to really hit it hard. So get my stuff done, get the vehicles done, get them sold, get them cleared out. Just, you know, getting everything done. Wow. <laughs> learn Facebook Marketplace so I can start selling stuff. I should do that today. I should sit down and learn how to do that today and start listing stuff. <sighs> Unbelievable. <laughs> Unbelievable. It feels weird. It feels very weird. After you've been in a job for three and a half years and you're going to lose it or leave it, not lose it, leave it. Um, it just feels really weird. But life changes always feel weird anyhow, don't they? So, wow. It's going to be happening in a few weeks. I'll be on the road. Unbelievable. <laughs> I will actually be free. You know, and part of this is I also tied myself down. Here comes somebody. Somebody just came in to pay their rent. This is really something. We'll probably go out to lunch tomorrow, my boss and I, and we'll discuss more. Camera's crooked. Tripod's crooked. Oh well, doesn't matter. <laughs> Wow, I'm going to be free. I am going to be free. Wow. Awesome. I have to get uh, my pets to the vet and get them all updated on shots, too. It's time to get that done. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just trying to process this. It's really something. Okay, well, here comes somebody else, so I'll catch you all in a bit. Okay, since I'm at work, I guess I should get some work done. 
Um, somebody else just came in to pay rent also. Um, so I'll, I'll, I'll add to this in a minute and maybe tomorrow because, uh, let you know how the lunch goes and what our conversation is as far as me with my rent and such. I think he'll be gracious about it. I mean, I know he'll be gracious about it. I've done a lot for this park. I've done a lot more than most people would do. So I think I'll be okay there. <laughs> okay, see you in a bit. these clouds they are awesome Okay guys, it's for reals. Absolutely, it's for real. I'm kind of in a state of shock. Um, of course, you know, I'm not a quitter, so it's really, really hard for me to leave a job. <sighs> this is happening. This is absolutely happening. Wow. I went out to lunch with my boss today and he wished me well. I didn't clean house. <laughs> and uh, he wishes me well. And um, it's all good. Uh, I told him, of course, I have to stay a few extra weeks anyhow. Because I have a lot of stuff to do. I mean, in the park. But I am definitely leaving my job next Friday. Today is April 22nd, 2021. And I will be, my last day will be Friday April 30th, 2021. <laughs> it's, it's hard to believe, actually. Yikes. So, yep, it's happening. It's happening. I am looking forward to leaving. I am looking forward to the travel. Uh, to seeing my family, of course. But I'm going to, you know, take a little bit of time. Do some side trips along the way maybe, <laughs> and see my sister in South Carolina. I'm anxious to see her. You know, they bought a house, and I think she'll be in it by then, but I don't know for sure. If she is, she might put me to work. I'm not sure. She says she needs somebody to help paint. We'll see about that. I can't believe this. I absolutely can't believe this. So anyhow, you know, I discussed it with my boss, and you know, told him, of course, I'll be here a few extra weeks and I'll be able to help transition the new girl into the job. And um, I asked him, you know, how do you want me to arrange my rent? And he said, don't worry about it. What a relief. That is such a relief. Because I've gone above and beyond for this park anyhow. So it's really nice to be rewarded that way. He's an awesome person. He really is. But it's really nice to be rewarded in those terms. So, wow. <laughs> wow, wow, wow. I have a lot to do. But fortunately, I'll be able to get it done now without um, constant interruptions. And I will be so glad to get rid of this. Yay. Sturdy. Get rid of this. Yeah, that's my office cell phone. <laughs> Won't be tethered to it anymore. Only downside is when I lose my other phone, I can't call it. <laughs> but, oh my gosh, this is really, really happening. Really happening. So my van is in the shop. Um, don't know if I'll get it tomorrow or not. They had to order a part for it. So I may or may not get it tomorrow. 
But as soon as I get it back, I can start hauling stuff and, um, you know, getting all the extra stuff out of the motorhome. I had to kind of stop with it for a little bit because I've got everything stacked up in it right now. It's, but I've got everything stacked up in it right now. And, uh, hey, <laughs> it's a tiny motorhome, so there's no room to move around. So I'll be glad to get my van back so I can throw the stuff that I'm purging into the back of the van. Well, check it out. Empty spot. What was in that spot? My van. Where's my van now? Finally, finally it's in the shop. Thank goodness. Whew. <laughs> Only took a, well, a week and a half to get it over there. <laughs> oh, really guys, this is happening. Wow, wow, wow. It's been a rough couple of months, as y'all know. I so appreciate y'all hanging with me, giving me words of encouragement. I, I appreciate your condolences on Buddy and Carlos. Um, yeah, we all, we all go through it. We all go through it. So, but uh, you guys are awesome. You, you're absolutely awesome. And I'm looking forward to taking you with me. You're going to go with me. <laughs> so anyhow, okay, I'm going to let y'all go. And um, thank you for watching. Live the life you love. And y'all take care out there. Goodbye.